Scientists continue to work on figuring out how the Omicron variant of COVID-19 works. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lucas Geisler. Deborah Kendrick is off tonight. Local health experts say today that people may want to continue or start practicing serious COVID-19 precautions. ABC 17's Layla Mitchell is live after looking into why the variant is a cause for concern. Layla, it could cause another COVID surge throughout the U.S. That's right, Lucas. Then there's still a lot that experts do not know about the variant, and this is just another reminder that the pandemic is not over. Now, right now, the Delta variant is the only variant that we're seeing in the state. You can see here from the pink squares, but health experts say from what they're seeing in other countries, Omicron could quickly become the leading variant in the state. This variant is a cause for concern, not a cause for panic. The newest variant, Omicron, has experts around the world saying it is a cause for concern. After its discovery a few weeks ago in South Africa, it became the dominant strain in the country. So why is it a concern? Um, one is because it actually has gained ground against Delta, and we have not seen any virus gain ground against Delta. There are still many unknowns about the variant, but Mark Johnson, microbiologist with MU, says the variant's large number of mutations is concerning. It has a lot of mutations, and those mutations are not random. They are very clearly mutations that are been selected for to evade an antibody response. A new variant has 32 mutations on its spike protein, which is the part of the virus responsible for infecting human cells. Experts fear the number of mutations could affect our response to the coronavirus vaccine. This is a virus that we know will have some resistance to vaccines. The local health experts say it is still important to be vaccinated. Vaccination is absolutely the best way to prevent infection and serious disease. Experts are still unsure if the variant is highly contagious and if it will make people sicker, but they say until more is known, people should take the necessary precautions. That masking in indoor spaces, especially in mixed groups, is, um, is still important. Experts say everyone 18 and older should take the next step and get their booster as the new variant makes its way into the United States. Layla Mitchell, thank you very much. Several local pharmacies, including Hy-Vee, Walgreens, and Walmart, are offering the booster shot.